In this video, we're going to look at how to calculate a derivative of a function using GeoGebra. We'll look at it a couple different ways. So let's start off by inputting a function. How about f of x equals x cubed? And remember, we can always change the view. It's, so I might want to center it a little more and make it a little wider. Don't have to, just to play around with it a little bit. So one easy way to, quick way to do a derivative. First off, I'm going to, let's say we want to find the first derivative. I'm going to give it a name, g of x, and I'm just going to set it equal to f prime of x. And there is my first derivative. Now if I want, I can go in to the object properties on f prime. I can rename it derivative or first derivative. Maybe I want to change the colors to make it a little bit more obvious. And there's my first derivative. There's another way of finding a derivative in GeoGebra. And it's to start to type the command. GeoGebra's got a ton of built-in commands. So I type in derivative, and it gives me some options <clears throat> as to commands I can use. And the first one I pick, I want to find the derivative function and number. So I want to find the derivative of f, and I push right to go over to number, and this is what derivative do I want to take. We already found the first derivative, let's find the second derivative there, and it's named it for me, f double prime of x in the algebra view. It's given it a blue color. We can go in there and change that very quickly. And there are the first two derivatives of our function, and we can find any derivative we want using either one of those methods.